Section 25 of Birds and All Nature, Volume 7, Number 2, February 1900. Recorded for LibriVox by Larry Wilson. Washington Monument by George P. Morris. A monument to Washington? A tablet graven with his name? Green be the mound it stands upon, and everlasting as his fame. His glory fills the land, the plain, the moor, the mountain, and the mart. More firm than column, urn, or fane, his monument, the human heart. The Christian patriot, hero, sage, the chief from heaven in mercy sent. His deeds are written on the age, his country is his monument. The sword of Gideon and the Lord was mighty in his mighty hand. The God who guided he adored, and with his blessing freed the land. The first in war, the first in peace, the first in hearts that free men own. Unparalleled till time shall cease, he lives immortal and alone. Yet let the rock-hewn tower rise high to the pathway of the sun, and speak to the approving skies our gratitude to Washington. End of section 25. This recording is in the public domain. End of Birds in All Nature, Volume 7, Number 2, February 1900.